Hey there, grade 10s. So we're going to be looking at the effect of frequency on wavelength. I'm going to be changing the frequency. You can just listen to it here. And we'll get higher and higher. But the cool bit is at certain resonant frequencies, we can see beautiful waves. If we're off on some ugly one, we don't really see anything. We need to be at only particular wavelengths and we'll get nice waves like that. For us, remember a wave, one complete wave goes up and down. We can't really see the down wave here. It's a standing wave more for grade 11 physics. Remember one wavelength, we'll have one up and one down. So one wave, two waves, three waves, four complete waves here. We're gonna measure the wavelength for this particular frequency. So let's read this off here. And I can see what that is. It's recorded in our table. And we use our ruler. And I'll put it down. And I'll measure from here to here. And I get our measurement. And we'll record that. And I'll change the frequency. So I get my independent variable I'm changing on purpose is the frequency what my dependent var variable is, is the wavelength. And I'm gonna measure this one. We can see that the wavelength is shorter. And this has something to do with what we studied last class. I'm not gonna say what those words are though. 